Hey guys, today I am going to talk about the strange environment Magic the Gathering creates. So the top four most embarrassing Magic the Gathering moments. Number four is a really recent one. It is Seth Manfield, who actually is our champion. He was playing a game of Magic. He got infected by adware. And honestly, he should be... You know, he is the Magic the Gathering champion. He should bless the lucky stars that that image wasn't something more worse. That image that popped up could have been something much, much worse. I mean, he had no control over it, of course. And you can see him very much in a panic state. They had to shut down the whole tournament and pre-record it just to prevent this guy from adware, which is crazy. Uh, number three was the DreamHack MTGA Arena. You would think in MTG Arena, things would be more less likely to happen, right? But uh, this comes from Alan Wu. Really wanted to shout out the DreamHack MTGA staff now. Been feeling sick and had a uncontrolled bowel movement and they extended the commercial break and somehow produced wet wipes and new pants for me managed to hold it together for a nice win against somebody i'm not familiar with uh, the reason i put this as number three is because there's not really um, a video evidence or photos of this i'm still looking for it but essentially the guy pooped his pants in, on in center stage in front of everyone and everyone was so proud that he actually won. So if the two options are not to poop my pants in public, I mean, I... So you poop your pants, now you have to get up, your opponent is smelling this, and it's like, what that blank's going on? Of course your opponent let you win. At that point in time, like, you know, any good human being would just be like, all right, this guy is uh, way more dedicated than I could ever be at this game. I'm just going to fold. It would not surprise me if the opponent intentionally allowed Allen to win because, uh, I mean, at that point, you, 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 I mean, at that point, I would question my own dedication. <laughs> like, I wouldn't poop my pants, you know, to continue to play. So if you really want to win this badly, and he was sick before, he probably knew that he had bowel movement issues. I'm pretty sure this is not the first time. And it, it is astounding that the coverage on this. So I thought if there had been video of it, if there had been some images, um, that this would be number one. Uh, because pooping your pants while playing Magic, specifically so you can play more Magic and not take a round loss... So somebody sent me this video because obviously I think they were, this was streamed and they extended the commercial break. So there must have, it had to be streamed somewhere, maybe on Twitch, and I would love to see a video of it. I would love to see their opponent's face. If I was the opponent, I would just fold right away. Again, this could have been number one. This absolutely could have been number one. It's just that we don't have video to show you. Um, now, would we actually want video to show you? Would you throw up? Uh, yes, you would throw up. I mean, imagine going to your local f and and you're playing, and then you hear, like, a fart noise, and also, like, now it's really smelly. And your local f and is probably not very big and doesn't have great circulation. And you're like, wait a second. And then your opponent gets up, the chair has brown on it, the pants have brown on it. What if they were wearing white pants? Jeez. And now they ran out to the bathroom and there's a trail of brown goo. But you know, well, you know, I give them credit. They knew this was going to happen. They had new pants ready for him, the same exact size. Like, I'm not saying that Alan had new pants ready. I'm saying that the dream hack had, must have had like a hundred pairs of different pant sizes all ready for someone to poop their pants. Which is also really great, but also kind of uh, weird that they would have pants at the ready. Like when you go to an anime convention, are you thinking, hmm, I should put a spare, you know, I should, man. 
All right, number two. We are now seeing someone in, in the background, as you can see on the top left, there's some naked dude, also Alan Wu. Again, Alan Wu is in two of the top four. <laughs> That's all you need to know about Magic the Gathering. You can see, oh, he comes out and he's gone. So his opponent is like, you can see at one moment in time, look at his opponent's face. He shrugs, he's kind of funny, it's kind of funny. The commentators are laughing. He's saying, now he's smiling, he's smiling some more. <laughs> He's looking, he's looking, he can't believe it. And he's like, okay, back to, <laughs> look, at, look at his opponent. Don't focus on the dude peeing in the background. Focus on his opponent's face during this interaction. And of course, Alan Wu won again. Is this the same guy who pooped its pants? I think so. I mean, how many Alan Wu's do we have in Magic? It could potentially be two different Alan Wu's, but given... So you got poop and pee in one dude. And so the reason I put this at number two is I think when everyone saw this, they were smiling because they thought how hilarious on live stream. Close the door, right? Close the blanking door. And you can see that Alan is so used to it that he's just ignoring it. Clearly, I mean, if you poop your pants and continue to win... I mean, very little is going to stop you. Like, what can stop you? Now, hygiene in Magic the Gathering have, has never been very good. I mean, poop, pee, porn ads. But number one has a very special place in my heart because even though these are kind of funny for Magic players, number one broke it out. I mean, we're talking about 40 million views we're talking about shares. We're talking about BuzzFeed article with 10 million views on itself. We're talking about Tumblr and Reddit that all went viral front page. It is butt crack Richman. Now, this has become a meme. So even though we have a dude peeing on camera, we have a dude pee, uh, pooping on camera, and we have sex ads from our Magic the Gathering champion, nothing ever will compare to this because... At this time, people really knew what Magic the Gathering was. Everyone knew what it was because it was being shared in non-Magic media, including BuzzFeed. And, I mean, it was hilarious. So, on this day, March 10th, 2014, Sin Blair uploaded an Immigrant album of a series of photos he and his friends took at Grand Prix Richmond, one of the biggest Magic the Gathering events of all time. These photos were hilarious. Uh, as of June 10th, 2015, the Immigrant album has over 5 million views and the Reddit post gathered more than 38,000 upvotes. And this was in 2015. So the amount of people who, if you show them this image, they would associate with Magic the Gathering is very high, even if they're not Magic players. So the pooping and the peeing, the sex ads, they all apply, like Magic players all know that, but if you told a non-Magic player, they wouldn't understand what you're talking about. This became a meme. This became huge. Now, did they ban the dude? They banned the dude. This became a meme within a meme. So let's talk about uh, Kotaku, Dairy, Daily Dot, Gawker, and Time. Time, Time Magazine even recorded it. So, I mean, that's for the normies, right? The gathering blogger, Matt Sterling, Blair claimed that he never intended to shame, bully, or harass anyone. Magic the Gathering magazine, Wizard of the Coast, said that Blair had been banned from violating the Magic Code of Conduct. A day later, Blair shared the comment section of the original post that the length of the ban was 18 months. Then he was unbanned. So, you have... People making memes out of memes out of memes. And then he came back. Um, Blair subsequently shared this on Reddit with a photo of him posting on a table in a room where a tournament would be held. The post managed to gather more than 45,000 votes in the first nine hours. Likewise, Blair's immigrant upload managed to gather over 18,000 points with 3.4 million views at the same period. 
So these are not, I mean, we're talking about 5 million views, 3.4 million views, um, 10 million views, 20. They can't be Magic players. Even though they supposedly tell us there are 20 million Magic players, I don't think the number is higher than 5. So even by mathematical statistics, even if every Magic player saw this, there were a lot of non-Magic players who saw it. And that's why this is the best of all time. Because this is Magic the Gathering. This is what people think of. 